Now that the dust has settled from the explosive debut of the Galaxy S25 Edge, all eyes are turning to what's next. And if you've been paying attention to the buzz, you already know, this summer is shaping up to be all about foldables. As we approach Samsung's highly anticipated July-August unpacked event, the company is rumored to be preparing for its most daring launch yet. Instead of the usual two foldables, we could be getting four. The Galaxy Z Fold 7, the Galaxy Z Flip 7, the Galaxy Z Flip 7 Fan Edition, and the long-rumored, wildly ambitious Galaxy G Fold, a triple-folding smartphone. In a major leak, insider Max Jamber revealed that live demo units of the Z Fold 7, Q7, Z Flip 7, B7, and Z Flip 7 Fan Edition B7R officially entered production on April 30th. That's a strong sign all three might launch together, a rare and thrilling moment for foldable fans. As for the mysterious Galaxy G Fold, there's still no word on whether it has entered production. But Samsung is known for surprise reveals, and many expect the G Fold could be teased at Unpacked with a full reveal coming later in the year. The Galaxy Z Fold 7 is already being called a showstopper. It's expected to feature a lighter, slimmer design, a new hinge that minimizes the crease, and a powerful 200 megapixel main camera in a triple lens setup. Under the hood, it's rumored to run on the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 Elite chipset, bringing next-level multitasking and incredible speed. The Galaxy Z Flip 7 is also getting a big glow-up, with slimmer bezels and a much larger cover display, rumored to be around 4 inches. In a bold move, it might become the first Galaxy foldable to use an Exynos processor, specifically the Exynos 2500, built on Samsung's advanced 3 nanometer process for better performance and power efficiency. Then there's the Galaxy Z Flip 7 Fan Edition, which could be Samsung's most affordable foldable yet. Despite its lower price, it's rumored to pack serious specs, including the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, 12GB of RAM, and the same 50 memepizzo main camera found in the Z Flip 6. Meanwhile, Samsung is facing tough competition from Chinese brands pushing slimmer, more advanced book-style foldables with bigger batteries and faster charging. But Samsung may finally be ready to strike back. The Galaxy Z Fold 7 could become the world's thinnest foldable, featuring a titanium backplate for extra strength and reduced weight. To achieve a thinner profile, Samsung might even remove the S Pen digitizer entirely, though reports suggest they're developing a new OLED display that can support a stylus without a traditional digitizer, in collaboration with High Deep. The fire started in Greece, shout out to Tech Maniacs, and then caught wind thanks to the ever-reliable tipster Anthony, aka at the Galax. The claim? The Galaxy Z Fold 7 could measure just 8.2 millimeters when folded. For context, the Oppo Find N5, currently the slimmest book-style foldable, is 8.9 millimeters. That would be a record-shattering 30% reduction in thickness compared to the Z Fold 6, which is 12.1 millimeters folded. But hold up, this sounds incredible, but also kind of unbelievable. Unfolded, it's just 4.54 mm thin. Fold it, and it sits at 9 mm, barely thicker than the current record holder, the Oppo Find N3. Its full dimensions? 158.43 by 140.3 by 4.54 mm. This isn't just slim, it's a feat of engineering brilliance. And the rear cameras? Completely redesigned. A sleeker triple lens system, each one in its own ring, vertically aligned in a minimal premium island. Panda Flash Pro reveals that the device now sports an ultra-slim 4mm profile when unfolded, with incredibly narrow 0.5mm bezels. When folded, it maintains an elegant 9mm thickness, proof that power and portability can coexist beautifully. Interestingly, Samsung is also reportedly increasing the gap between the folded halves, a decision that may seem odd at first, but is intended to protect the display from added stress when the phone is shut, ultimately extending the device's longevity. Leaks strongly suggest the Galaxy Z Fold 7 is headed for a July launch, and if the rumors hold true, this won't just be a minor refresh. Instead, it could be one of Samsung's biggest foldable upgrades yet. One of the most exciting leaks, echoed by multiple sources and again highlighted by Panda Flash Pro, points to a massive camera leap, a brand new 200 megapixel main sensor. This is a huge step up from the 50 megapixel camera in the Z Fold 6 and could be the same sensor set to debut in the Galaxy S25 Ultra. If true, it could deliver DSLR level image quality in a foldable form factor. Straight from China, a leaked image of a mysterious transparent case is shaking up the entire tech community. 
the image shows a new case allegedly made for the Z Fold 7, sitting right beside a known Fold 6 ring case. At first glance, not a big deal, but zoom in and you'll see game-changing clues. The corners are more squared off, the camera cutouts sharper and more refined, and yes, it looks slimmer. According to a stunning new report from reliable tipster Felix, Samsung is about to make a bold leap. The upcoming Galaxy Z Fold 7 might not only become the thinnest foldable phone in the world, but also the strongest, thanks to a titanium backplate. Unlike the Galaxy S25 Ultra, which uses titanium just for the frame, the Fold 7, and even Samsung's upcoming Trifold, could feature titanium on the backplate itself. This marks a major shift in both durability and design. Interestingly, Samsung already began experimenting with this in the Z Fold Special Edition, which quietly introduced titanium into the foldable lineup. According to renowned tipster Ice Universe, Samsung is making major strides with its next-gen foldable. According to Panda Flash Pro, Samsung has reimagined four core elements of the fold lineup. The hinge has been completely redesigned, offering smoother folds and dramatically enhanced durability, making the device feel sturdier and more premium than ever. The inner display has received upgraded layering, resulting in sharper visuals and improved structural integrity for a more immersive viewing experience. A new vapor chamber dramatically improves thermal efficiency, allowing the Fold 7 to stay cool even during heavy multitasking or gaming. And the upgraded ultra-thin glass, UTG, adds a layer of flexibility and strength, making every fold feel seamless and precise. On the software side, leaks suggest that both the Fold 7 and Flip 7 could launch with One UI 8 based on Android 16, skipping over the current One UI 7 entirely for a major leap in user experience right out of the box. Panda Flash Pro reports that mass production has already begun, aligning with a July release window. Renders show an ultra-thin design and improved dust resistance, while excitement builds around other possible releases at the upcoming Unpacked event including a new trifold foldable. Trusted leakers suggest the Galaxy G Fold will debut alongside the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Z Flip 7 in July. What's exciting is that Samsung seems to be unifying its foldable lineup with a shared design language. The G Fold and Z Fold 7 are expected to feature the same speaker layout and a new hinge mechanism that helps the device lie completely flat when open potentially eliminating those annoying display creases that have bugged foldable users for years. The G Fold is also expected to share several internal components with the Z Fold 7. Even though it will include an extra hinge and a third display, using the same core hardware across devices helps reduce production costs while maintaining quality. A smart move on Samsung's part and one that might ensure a consistent premium experience, especially when it comes to sound and build. Display-wise, the G Fold could be a game-changer. Leaks suggest a 6.49-inch outer screen and a massive 9.96-inch inner display. That's almost tablet-sized. And instead of folding outward like Huawei's Mate X, the G Fold is rumored to fold inward, making the design more protective. It will need both a front-facing display for quick tasks and a large inner screen for immersive multitasking or media use. Samsung has already teased trifold concepts, and during its recent Q1 2025 earnings call, the company emphasized its focus on form factor innovation. That's a big hint, considering it hasn't released a completely new foldable design since 2020. It really does seem like the G Fold's time has come. Now, don't expect this next gen device to come cheap. Reports suggest the Galaxy G Fold could be priced even higher than the Z Fold 6, which launched at around $1,899. An early word is that it may be exclusive to China and South Korea at launch. If true, international fans might have to wait longer or consider importing.